This PowerPoint presentation or instructional video is based on the most essential learning competency, which is to describe the appearance and uses of homogeneous and heterogeneous mixtures. This competency is subtasked into three topics. We will focus on the first topic for today. Our topic for today is all about solutions and other uniform mixture. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell button for more instructional videos. Welcome my dear learners. It's nice to see you again. Are you excited for a fun learning session? I know you are all excited and ready to learn. Uniform or homogeneous mixtures are liquid mixtures in which you cannot clearly see the components or ingredients. Examples of uniform mixtures are rubbing alcohol, seawater, and fruit juices. One type of uniform mixture is the solution. In a solution, the additive is dissolved and thoroughly mixed into the main component. The main component is called the solvent, or usually in greater amount, while the dissolved additive is called the solute, or usually in lesser amount. For example, in a solution consisting of 100 ml of water and 2 tablespoons of sugar, the sugar is the solute or the substance that is dissolved, and the water is the solvent, the substance that is used to dissolve. Water is an example of a solvent that dissolves many substances. This is why it is often referred to as the universal solvent. Some solutes dissolve easily than others. This property of solute is called solubility. When you put sugar and salt in separate glasses with the same amount of water, more sugar will dissolve. This is because sugar is more soluble than salt. Solutions vary in concentration. If you put more solute in the same amount of solvent, the resulting solution becomes concentrated. For example, a salt water solution will become concentrated if more salt is added unto it. On the other hand, if you add more solvent with the same amount of solute, the resulting solution becomes diluted. With the salt water solution, adding more water into it will make it diluted. A concentrated solution has more solute and less solvent, while a diluted solution has less solute and more solvent. Miscibility Liquids are miscible when they dissolve into each other to form a homogeneous mixture. For example, alcohol is miscible in water. They form a homogeneous mixture. On the other hand, liquids are immiscible when they do not dissolve into each other and do not form a homogeneous mixture. For example, oil and water. Oil does not mix with water. When a small amount of oil is mixed with water, the oil floats on top of the water as little blobs. When so much oil gets spilled on water, it forms a layer on top of the water. Oil is immiscible in water. Other types of homogeneous mixtures. Letter A. Gaseous. 
Example of gaseous mixture is air. Air is a mixture of different kinds of gases. Our atmosphere or the air surrounding the earth is composed of 78% nitrogen and 21% oxygen. The remaining 1% is made up of carbon dioxide, argon, and many other gases. Since we cannot easily separate these different gases from each other, air is considered a gaseous homogeneous mixture. Sometimes it is called a gaseous solution. Letter B is solid. Example of these are alloys. In these solid mixtures of metals, the component metal cannot be individually identified. Therefore, they are called solid homogeneous mixtures. Sometimes, they are called solid solutions. They are alloys. Now, let's have an activity. Read and analyze the questions carefully. Choose the letter of the correct answer. Are you ready?